Hi everyone, Mr Burke here. Welcome to our last assembly of the term at Renfrew High. Delivered to you in quite an unusual way. However, really pleased to bring to you today some messages from your year heads and some final thoughts from me as we end this very unusual term together as a school community. So first up, let's hear from the deputy heads with a message for their year groups. Hi, Mrs Shaw here. This is a message for all my S1 and S2 pupils. Um, didn't want the term to officially end without saying to you, I hope you're all well. I hope you're all doing everything that you've been asked in terms of keeping your social distancing, etc. And looking after yourselves and your families. I know this is a really strange time for us all, um, being at home instead of being in school, um, you know, through the week. But obviously you'll know... Um, through so, show my homework all our teaching staff have put loads of work on for you don't get overwhelmed by it just do what you can a bit at a time each day um keep active that's the most important thing and um, keep focusing on you know what's important to you and obviously when all this passes which i'm hoping will be you know in the next few months we'll all be able to get back to some kind of normality and um, in the meantime i hope that you have a good easter break i know it's going to be very different to everything that we've had before but i need you to make sure that you above all are staying safe so look after yourselves and your families keep well and hopefully we'll see you all again um next session okay take care bye Hello S3, it's Mr Sutherland here, I hope you're all safe and well and so are your families. If we were at school just now we would be having an assembly to celebrate the end of term and at that assembly I would be discussing how proud I am of the journey you guys have made from S1 through to S3 in the broad general education and I'm sure your teachers would all agree. Um, I would be talking about the importance of preparing yourself as well as you can for S4 and in that regard, after these are all these, please make sure you're engaging as much as you can with the work your amazing teachers are putting on Show My Homework and other means. Uh, we always have a timely focus in terms of our values and next term it would definitely have to be care. It's so important now more than ever to care for each other, care for yourselves, care for the people you live with. Um, and you've all got a responsibility where you're at home just now to make sure that you're contributing to a positive atmosphere within the house. So make sure that you're pulling your weight, you're being kind, and as I, as I would expect. Um, it's more important than ever to check in with your friends and your classmates, and the use of social media just now is really important. So make sure you're using that positively and responsibly. The next few months will be difficult and different than we've ever experienced, and I'm sure when we come back, we'll all have a renewed appreciation for the things that we maybe took for granted in the past, whether it's the social interactions or the experiences we get in school. Um, so when it does come to that, I look forward to seeing you all. Um, take care of yourselves, take care of your families, and I'll hopefully see you soon. Thank you. Hello to all my fourth years, and hello again to my sixth years who are having the second assembly with a video message from me recently. Um, I'm healthy and well. I hope you and your families are too, and you're continuing to follow the advice and guidance so that we get through this as quickly as possible, and I'll look forward to seeing you all back at school as soon as possible. Um, for any of my fourth years who were planning and are still thinking about leaving school, um, please get in touch through the school website, send us an email and let me know how your plans are going and if you need any help or advice with anything, please do get in touch. I'll see you all on the other side. Stay safe. Be well. Hey S5, this is not the way I thought I would be giving you your Easter assembly message, but here we are. By now, either Pupil Support or myself will have contacted, contacted you just with a wee check and phone call. If you have not received a call from us, it's either because you have not updated your contacts with the school or we got a voicemail and we've left a message. I know this is uncertain times for us all, it's not ideal, but here we are. So this is what I ask for you. Number one, be kind to yourself and others. Even if you are getting under each other's feet at home, be calm, be patient and appreciate each other. Remember that everyone deals with these kind of things in different ways. Number two, keep safe and healthy, both physically and mentally. Try and do something active every day, even for 30 minutes. Don't sit around on your Xbox or your PlayStation all day every day. Don't isolate yourself from others, unless obviously you have to. Connections with family are really, really important right now, and that's what will get you through this. Stay inside, so don't go outdoors, no going to the skate park or anywhere else, stay inside, it's really, really important. Do something new every day to keep each day interesting or challenging, 
do a family quiz, um, a family challenge, read a book, um, a, a challenge with your friends, virtually, obviously. Make productive time for yourself each day and for your family. This will maintain your good well-being. Plan the night before what you're going to do the next day so you've got some kind of structure to your day, otherwise every day will roll into each other. Number three, if you're worried about anything at all, email the inquiry's email address on our website and this will filter through to me at some point. So S5, on that note it's adios from me, I miss you all, keep safe, keep well and I hope to see you all soon. Oh, and before I go, I would never ask you to do anything I wouldn't do myself. So here is my challenge to myself. Give it a try if you have not already. Post it on Twitter. Like Red for High into it so I can see how you get on. Okay, bye. <laughs>some messages from your ear heads um, know that they are missing you and thinking about you as I am too and let's just hope that, that we get through this current crisis as safely and as quickly as possible and that we're all back together in Renfrew High learning, achieving and working together as soon as it's safe and as possible I want to finish with a message for firstly third year just saying that after the Easter break We'll continue to provide you with opportunities to learn digitally and if there's anybody who's got any problems accessing that, we'll make sure that we get hard copies delivered to households so that you can all continue to keep yourself challenged and moving on in your learning. And to 4th, 5th and 6th year, I totally get how anxious you must be right now given what's happened with the exams across the country and across other countries. You're not alone and what we need to do at this moment is remember the core values of the school and you need to trust that your teachers and school leaders are going to do all that we possibly can because of the care we have for you. Um, you need to trust and respect our decisions and judgments over the weeks and months to follow that our absolute aim is that everybody in 46 year achieves what they deserve and what they would have got if this current situation had not happened. The scenario we're dealing with is not perfect and it won't be perfect, but working within the national parameters that will become available to us, we will do absolutely all we can for each and every one of you. So in the meantime, folks, enjoy the Easter break as much as you possibly can. Please do the right things and stay safe and look after yourself, look after each other. Take care, everyone.